So first things first, you want to make sure your title is optimized. How do you know whether the title is searchable or not? I personally use TubeBuddy in order to get to the bottom of it. TubeBuddy is a free external software that you can download and sync it with your YouTube and you can use it to do keyword research for tags and titles and get ideas of what kind of wording to use in your description. You can use the free version. I used it for the first three, four months of when I just started YouTube, the free version, and I liked it so much. Now I have the proof. Now I have the pro version of TubeBuddy. I believe I paid about $80 for a year to have the pro version which basically gives me a lot more insights on the keywords and unlimited search for titles so what I want to show you right now is how I do the title research and choose the titles step one how to pick the title first we're going to get our title that we think is going to perform which is how to grow your YouTube channel fast in 2020 Second, we're going to TubeBuddy. I've already downloaded and synced it in with my YouTube and when you do on the top right corner, you're gonna get that icon for TubeBuddy. You click on that, you go to Keyword Explorer and you get a search bar that is synced with the YouTube search bar. Anything you search over here is as if you're searching it on YouTube search bar itself. So I'm going to paste my title that I think is going to perform and I'm going to explore to see what the ranking is. I'm going to look for the score, I'm going to look for the average view and the lowest, count, lowest view count of the video that I got. Now over here you see how the ranking, the rating is 11 out of 100 for my title and on the bottom says the score above is specific to your channel. You want to keep that in mind that these keyword researches are specific to your channel. How your channel is established on YouTube's page and what kind of topic you're searching and thinking of doing for your channel. For example, if your channel is about cooking and all of a sudden you start doing other videos such as YouTube tips, then most likely the search score is going to be not so accurate for you because your channel is established as a cooking page and now you want to do a YouTube video. So that's why you always want to make videos within your niche so this Keyword Explorer tool can be as accurate as possible. Right now, our title got us 11 out of 100. The search volume is actually excellent, which means there are many, many people who search for this title on YouTube. However, the competition is horrible. The um, optimization strength, which means this number represents how well optimized the top ranking videos are for the research phrase. That means the videos that are on YouTube currently, in other words, the competition of the, your video that you're thinking of putting out is very, very well optimized, which means it's going to be very hard for our video to break through and rank up top above all those videos because the videos that are already existing with this title on YouTube have excellent optimization strength. Also, over here you're going to see number of videos in search results. So, with this title, there are about 33.8 million videos on YouTube, which means your video is going to compete with 33.8 million videos out there. I wouldn't recommend that. Average view is getting 32,700 and the lowest count view is getting 7,068. Now you might say, Gore, but the lowest count view is so low. That means it's a good sign. The lowest amount I'm going to get is 7,068 views. Yes, that's one way of thinking. However, you need to keep in mind that the optimization strength of the videos on YouTube are excellent, which means these are top top ranking channels who are dominating the top ranking places which means it is close to impossible to take over those top ranking places based on our statistics that we receive so i would recommend you to do a further title research and this is why the second title comes into play so let's go get our second title option second title option is identical to the first the only addition is the last part small youtuber tips so we're going to get the whole title we're gonna copy it we're gonna go back to keyword explorer and we're going to explore the new topic hoping to get a better ranking 
Now, did you see from 11 out of 100, our ranking went to 61 out of 100, and it's actually very good now. Let's check it out. The search volume is really good. That means there are a lot of people searching for this title. Competition is really good. That means there, uh, if competition is decent, which means there is enough room for us to break through. Optimization of the search strength for other videos, our competition videos are still excellent like the previous one which means it's going to be a bit harder to break through. However, the number of videos in search result is only 2,333,000 versus 38 million. Now, your, videos, uh, your video that you're making is going to compete against 2.3 million videos instead of 38 million videos. If you were to ask me, you would have had a better chance to get your video ranked up with less videos competing against 10 more. Obviously, that's common. Obviously, that makes sense, right? And your lowest count is 126, which actually gives you a realistic idea of that the top ranking videos are still ranking up even with low views. And if you want to confirm that, you want to go to results. Now, the first top video that ranked has only 4,000 and five views with only 4005 views this video is up top number one over video that has 133,000 views this is because our wording of the title allows us for the video which is getting less views to rank up number one over video that's getting more views to rank up number two. And this is why I highly recommend to do title research and have a backup title as well.